I don't know. Anywho, um, what's up, y'all? Uh, this is uh the homeboy Jason, and uh, that redneck fucker over there. My name is Say Willa up, T. Redneck. Franklin, and don't you forget it. Mm-hmm. We got you back on commentary. Hey, bud. The show is yes, starting, we and we are here on Super Flat Night. Yes, we are. And my god, are we in for a fucking show tonight? Dean, we are. The final, uh, the final two Fatal 4 Ways will be deciding the n final women to be a part of the Fatal 4 Way for the women's title. <laughs> women. <laughs> Usually I have a screen to watch this shit on, but I, I guess Walter you D. Keep. Franklin said fuck you. It's Walla T. Franklin, you piece of shit. We're in Brooklyn, New York. Yeah, Brooklyn, the home of every Italian in America. Upcoming first, we got Coda Imura uh, going nothing. against the Tony Storm. Hey, faggot! No, that ain't him, that mind. Well, hello, nurse! What the fuck are you doing? Oh, what the fuck? I know I can hook my PS4 up to this uh, broadcast little thing here, so you know. Oh, really? We have oh, Cody really? Amura going up against Tony Storm. Yeah, I know we're near a better than. What? <laughs> Again, currently 24 of them, I'm sure. Again. Jason, who do you think is uh, gonna come out on top in this match? So fucking ow, bitch. Hello? Die, cunt. Excuse me? What? Uh, yeah, um... Uh, I think Coda's gonna win. Because Coda's a good guy. And, uh, Coda, Coda got all the tools. Hey, bud. Hey, this shit's not gonna... Mm-hmm. <laughs> Outcoming next is Tony Storm. Nigger. Yeah, Tony Storm. Jesus Christ, dude. Come the fuck on. What? Kind of wish it took me screaming a little bit. Maybe. Maybe. Where's that other black boy? The other black friend. Derek? Yeah, Derek. He said he'll be back. Oh. So are you not so are you still streaming? What? Are you still streaming? No, I, I am. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the first. He broke character. <sighs> you see, now you can hear a lovely no. voice and not that rough ass redneck, whatever the fuck you would know. Remember, I'll Don't take a it storm with an Irish whipping hook corner. And now, flipping immediately in that beautiful sunlight DDT. And did Tony God Storm. Goddamn. God damn, boy, now I tell you what, back in my day, this was some good action here. We had to pay 99 cents to watch this type of action. It was a good action, too. <coughs> I remember my first match. Good lord, it was a match, too. I flew into a man's in. I can't fucking go up there. Go to with a springboard headbutt into a snapmare takedown. And now. Going after the legs of Tony Storm. 
out of all my 95 wives, I figure that the one that has the black tooth. What the what fuck I mean? are you talking about? What? What the fuck are you talking about? Oh, my bad. I was uh, sending a voice message. You know, my, my, my grandson taught me how to send voice messages on that little uh, app called Messenger. I forget he black. I think I forgot to mention that he's black. You're on the black grandkids. Tony Storm immediately with a kick out. Okay, never mind. Guess you're not the talkative type. Tony Storm now on the offensive. Going to the ropes. And now Tony with a huge clothesline. Sending Coda on the outside. Coda yeah, uh, getting back in the ring. Stopping Tony Storm in his tracks from that suicide dive. And now Coda. Immediately. Going for his patented people's moonsault. Landed right on target, and now Coda going for the cover. What the fuck are you doing, man? Okay. That, okay. I hate to do this to you, but. Okay. And now Coda going up to the top rope here. And a huge twisting shooting star press from the top rope. Coda looking to end it here. Going with a springboard. Forearm smash. Going with a cover on storm. One, two, four. Oh, vicious kick out at two. Coda now. Looking to deal some damage to the arms of Tony. Looking to dissect this man. Coda now up to the top rope. Flying kick. Oh, Tony got out of the way. And a knee. Run to the back. And now Tony. Looking for an inverted. So, some kind of Indian death lump. Oh, and a vicious kick right into the midsection. Tony now. I'm for a high knee. For a high jumping knee. Now Storm. Looking for another moonsault. Oh, went for a frog splash, and now going with a leg drop. Missed here, that here, too. I'm here. I'm here. I'm and here. another high knee from Storm. I'm here. Hello there. Sorry, the I'm sure I'm pretty sure you know Dollar General. It's Twelve o'clock up here. Double rotation oh, moon song. Um, cover one, two. Oh, barely a kick out at two. And now Tony Storm, trying to get back on the offensive here. Super kick, no, dodge out the way. Anyone, Anyone ever can roll What's up? Anyone ever had Orange Strawberry Sunny D? I've never heard of that. I'll, tell you, I'll let you know how it is by the end of the day. I'm eating the original now, but... Interesting. Alright. Pull this up on my Coding phone. Coding now. Cody, you're a little far from home here. Cody now realizes this. And now throwing Storm in over the top rope. Onto the outside. Please be clear. This is an invasion. And now Cody going on to the outside. Elbow to the ear. Right, Bicycle knee. Wait a minute. Into a poison run. Oh, that's his finisher. Coda it's just got spacked on the water. outside. Mm. And now, throwing Coda into the ring post. Oh. 
Tony Storm in full control here. And now throwing Coda into the bear into the into the ring. Into the ring post several times over. Tony is snorting looking for a power bomb here. The hell yes. you look? Power bomb on the mm. apron and on to the side of the ring. Take right to the midsection. Oh. And now Coda now. We got a seven count. And now both men entering the ring. Back to the stalemate now, Coda. Looking for the offensive here. Looking for power slam. Tony with a shot right to the knee. Mm. And now Tony Storm. So you're looking for here. Oh, roll for went for a rolling forearm. Coda caught it. And now Coda going after the legs again. Oh, Jesus. Oh, got caught him with a forearm of his own. And now Coda stalking the man. Beating him down. Tony, bicycle knee again. Into the poison rona. Oh, it's got to be it. Cover. One, two, go two point nine. Coda barely kicking out. And now Tony Storm going to the top rope again. Coda staggering to his feet. Tony, calling him with a flying clothesline. Wait a minute, calling him with a roll up. Playing possum. One, no, kick out at one from Tony Storm. And now Tony, kick right to the midsection, go for a DT, and got flipped out. Coda now, looking for something big here. Looking for some elbows. I see that's, that's, that's probably his thing. And now Coda now, oh! Standing over Tony Storm in a gloating fashion. And now Coda, looking to end this here. He's got Tony. Backstabber, rolls into it. Rolls into the submission hole. Rolls into a modified cross face. Tony Storm in trouble here. He's right in the middle of the ring. Yeah, he can't get to the ropes. He's got nowhere to go. Tony's in trouble. T Tony could tap out right here. He's being bent like a pretzel. Being folded like a <laughs> lawn chair. Seeing stars. Tony's still trying to fight out of here. Wait a minute. Tony rolls him up. Rolls him out of the submission hole. One, two, three, and Tony Storm. Holy Got him. Shit. Oh, I'm about to get the feet right. Oh, wow. He cradled his fucking leg perfectly. He managed to roll him up successfully. Incredible Tony move by fucking... Tony Storm. Tony is pissed. Kona has a right to be pissed. Yeah, he he had right, dead to right. rights. Both of these men fought incredibly hard. He had them dead to rights. Dead to rights. It's one of my favorite games. You remember that? Dead, dead, dead to rights? I think so. We got how it is like Siberian Husky. God, I love it. Interesting. God, that poison run up. Uh, that, <laughs> beautiful. That roll up, too. Tony Storm. Stared daggers at Coda, and now gloating in his victory. Where the fuck? Tony Storm is your winner, and now we are on our third fatal four way for the women's championship. We have. Heartless LaBelle, I think that's how she calls it, Ivy Rose Patel, Tristan Doan, and Amber Young. I like Amber Young. She's very, uh, from what I could tell, she's a very capable wrestler. She's a very capable, uh... You want to finish that sentence? All Today's right. episode is brought to you by Sunny D. Uh, I don't think we actually have the rights to do that.
Say that to Buffy by hate crime. Oh well, no good shit. <clears throat> oh, I feel like I can take over the world now. Hey, yep. I wouldn't do that. Commented. You want a sip? Say that to Buffy by common sense. Who the f- who, who, is, who is he talking to? What is he talking about? No idea. <laughs> and hey, hey, first he's Tristan Dawn. Jacob, you need to talk about something, fam? Jason. Nah, I mean, I can embarrass you both, but I'm not going to. What? Alright, then. Somebody else, I don't, I don't. <laughs> now coming is Tristan Dawn. This is Smokey's sister, apparently. I don't like her. <laughs> Why is that? I never met, a, I never met anyone who has Dawn in their name, and I actually liked them. Fair enough. I don't like her. Mm-hmm. And smoky and every 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 seed they came. In. What the hell? Shit. I'm gonna put my move over. It's not good enough. What? Sister can't run. Huh? Oh, I'm I'm talking about this person I'm fighting, Skyrim. Yeah, that's all. Outcoming next is Amber Young. She should win. I hope she wins. Because she's the best. Let's see. We've had a series of upsets. The other and the last two fatal four ways were two members of the human anomaly as the victors. Tabitha Black Art and Roxy Apocalypse. Hmm. That was a good look. Tiber set and brought peace to Tamriel and T. Amber Young getting the crowd hyped, ready to lay some groundwork and get to the women's championship. Who are you most familiar with in this in this uh, Fatal Four Way, Derek? To be honest, none of them. Mm. But I got fresh eyes for every single one of them. All right. Outcoming next is Ivy Rose Patel, a recommended superstar by the man of Matt Rush. Hmm. High expectations, then. Yep, according to him, he and she beat the shit out of him. If he, it, she would beat the shit out of him if uh, if she didn't get a contract. Uh oh. So let's see what happens. I hope she doesn't get a. <clears throat> I mean, uh. Let's hope she doesn't shit the bed. She should. Oh no. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I would like to see that beat down. Her beating the shit out of Matt Rush. Oh. Or her losing the match. Uh, I thought I thought I thought you were saying uh, he would beat her ass if she didn't get a contract. No, she would beat his ass. Ah, uh, it's not fun than that. <laughs> oh. I need to see him hit her with the jaw jaw grip slap. <laughs> or me, either, either one. I don't think I don't think you can do I don't think either of you can do that. You're both on the same show, and you're in two completely different di uh, divisions. Plus, um, plus she's trained with Matt Gray. I don't care. Never lose to a woman. <laughs> Never. 
Never except say for, never, except Derek. For, uh, except for uh, except for uh, Spitfire, it's the only woman that got a cheap shot in on me. Don't let him hear you say that. Recorded. And finally, coming out is Heartless LaBelle. Patty LaBelle? Heartless LaBelle. Oh, I want to see Patty LaBelle wrestle again. She's from France. Ooh. Suddenly, my attention has been captured. Even more. <laughs> ooh, she, ooh. She's a rough grit. Submissions type spe uh, specialist. Let's see if she uh, let's see if she wins this. I got five. Oh God, I like. That's cool how she went through the ropes. Dawn, young, but ill, and heartless. Here we go. Red shoes, ring the bell. Yeah, I'm coming first. We got Ivy and Tristan going at it. Yes. And LaBelle and Young. Button heads. Or Come on, I Patty. Mm. I don't think her name is Patty. It should be. Going to lock up here. And now LaBelle throwing her over the top rope. Oh, double knees run to the jaw. Oh, wait a minute. Dawn now. Joking STO takedown. And now Ivy. Mm. With a series of nasty strikes. Dragon suplex. And mm. Rose. Or not Rose. Heartless gets That's taken good. down. And a nasty pump handle back suplex. Ivy taking control of this matchup here. That's a good suplex, though. So it should always do. Throwing the mail to the barricade. And now these two. These two button heads. All three of these women button heads. Harless now. Roundhouse kick. Laying out Patel. Ooh. And now Dawn and LaBelle. Trading blows in the ring now. Snap her takedown. And now the technical specialist versus the MMA specialist. Oh, wait a minute. What the hell is it? Ooh, drive by knee into a neck breaker. LaBelle, stalking what Dawn the now. Fuck? What happened? Um. Uh, Ooh. There's. Amber the Young getting jumped now. Still fighting back, though. Amber Young looking for. Oh, Poison Rona to Ivy. Hmm. And now looking to damage the arm while LaBelle gets her legs torn apart through the ropes. Looking for a roll-up on Dawn here. One. No, kick out. Oh, and attacking. Heartless. Um, looking for a Southern Light suplex. Hmm. And Dawn just kicking her while she's down. Amber Young trying to make quick work. Slow, methodical attacks on Ivy. Roll up again on Dawn with an immediate kick out. We have several different fighting styles in this ring. Derek, do you still uh, not have a clear winner? So far, I like the, far I like the, I like the French babe. Oh my god, what a roundhouse to the face. Laid her clean out. She's got a baseball bat. Doesn't mm. work out. Oh, what a paley kick from Young. And now, charging. Look for a knee. Right across the face of Ivy. Patel running away from the crazy chick with a baseball bat. Face first into the turnbuckle now. Oh, and the baseball bat across the back again. Dawn. The raising hell against her. Oh, wait a minute. Snap DDT. And now Patel. In a modified Boston Crab. 
bending Ambert or Will. And now, Heartless. Oh, a double stomp. Ambert's just getting. Oh, the double team on Patel. It's everyone from herself here. All these women just beating the hell out of one another, ganging up on one another, and then just going after a free-for-all again. Strike after strike, blow for blow. Running clothesline. Amber Young. Oh, gets caught with a huge big elbow strike. Cover. One. Two. Oh, huge kick out from Amber Young. And now, the LaBelle lock. She calls it the LaBelle lock. The crossface submission hole. Rich and back at the neck. And Ivy. Ivy gets back in the ring. Ivy, she's back in the Crowfot ring. Crawford suplex. It's a good suplex. Ivy now. Drive by knee into the neck breaker. Ivy back up to her feet. Hmm. Huge side suplex, double knees to Young. Oh, wait a damn minute. Oh! Cracking her skull open with that knee. One, two, three. Ivy Rose Patel moves Hallelujah. on. Hallelujah. Drove her knee right into the skull. Of course, she pinned the person that I said was no. That's not fair, Curse bro. Curse of the commentators, Derek. You know that. Whatever. Look at that nasty back elbow. She almost won with that. Brandon Ace is not too happy about the ending of this matchup here. And Ivy Rose Patel. Standing tall above all these women. She will be facing the likes of Roxy Pucalypse and Tabitha Blackheart. And the main event, whoever wins that, will be the fourth and final member to fight for the women's title in a fatal four-way elimination match. We have the returning Wild Cosmo going up against Aurora Hartfilia. Derek. Mm -hmm. who, who do you got in this match? I don't know. It seems like my picks have been fucking wrong. Probably, probably, probably Heartfella. Heartfella, I heard you say I think it's... Uh, oh, oh, heart... Felia? Felia? Felila? Oh, have mercy. <laughs> Felila? Women's Wrestling! Hello, Phenomeno! Out coming first, one of the other members of the Human Anomaly, Aurora Hortphelia. What the hell is that? Chicken. That don't look like no chicken. That looks like a skull. <laughs> that might be a skull, yeah. They. Has anyone ever told you if you make a drink out of a person's skull, you remember their name? Yeah. Person put a got a skull of a guy named Phil. Put it uh put orange juice and vodka in there. Say it was a Phillips head screwdriver. <sighs> that was a good one. That was a good one. Uh, that, that was that was a good one. <laughs> so wait, if that means wait a minute, if that means uh, if that means uh, when one of the Steiners uh, when one of the Steiners croak, does that mean it's gonna be a Steiner screwdriver, an actual Steiner screwdriver? Uh, it might be. I don't see why it wouldn't. 
Interesting. It should. It should. He should definitely be a Steiner screwdriver. Or just one of the Steiners actually drinking a fucking screwdriver. It wouldn't surprise me. What the fuck would it be? I feel like you thought of them actually drinking a tool screwdriver instead of the screwdriver drink. I mean, one of them did, uh, like, like what worked out with a fucking tree bark. Or the trunk, or tree trunk, I should say. Like, yeah. Fair enough. <laughs> Out coming next is Wild Cosmo, and she's yeah. stuck. Is that she's got a tank herself? What the hell? Nigga making a goddamn uh, workout video with tree trunks. How many Two people? Four, um, how many people on this damn uh, show, on this uh, roster, have a tank? They've probably written the same tank from uh, the same person. So Wild Cosmo and Spitfire rent the same tank. I mean, it is the same thing. <laughs> huh. Interesting. The same skull, the same three letters. <laughs> hmm. Same ammo. <laughs> Coincidence? I think not. I don't know what fucking dealership has tanks. Like, what the hell? <laughs> what kind of dealership All has right. tanks? <laughs> Uh, I'm looking for the 2008 Mercedes uh, uh, tank roller. The day I see a Mercedes tank will be the day I move to Russia. I'll just wait, bro. It's going to become a TikTok trend soon. Everyone's going to have to fucking do it. Oh, yeah, the hell. Start having tanks for that shit. They just spend Inst three bands to rent. Instead of gun control, it's tank control. Mm. How do we protect ourselves? We get tanks on the road. It's not le it's not considered a gun. I'm just gonna keep walking. <laughs> you might get there quicker. Alright. Here we go. The match begins. Aurora. Starting no strong. Don't walk Osmo over the top rope and now. Stunner! Sending her to the floor. Oh, wait a minute, Cosmo! Oh! Caught her, uh... Caught her on the ropes, and now... Sh just staring daggers at one another. Wait a minute, oh! Stopped her dead in her tracks, and now Aurora! Hammerlock DDT! Throw her into the announcement table! And again! Just tossing her like she's a paperweight. I mean, she is, isn't she? Well, that ain't right. Didn't you see her tag match with Coda right. just the other week? Sorry. Right. I'm just trying to pay my taxes like everybody is. Oh, bro. Isn't a deadline for that late now? Don't remind the IRS. <laughs> And now, waiting for an uppercut now. Wild well, Cosmo trying to trade shots with Orphelia in a super kick, laying her ass flat out. Mm. Throwing her up. Oh, and caught her when she tried to make a reversal. Heart feeling now. Oh, takes a body shot now. Cosmo, kick right to the midsection. A prism bomb! A prism bomb from Wild Cosmo. And now going to the top rope here. Elbow drop! Marora rolls out the way. That doesn't stop Cosmo though. Cosmo on a tear, on a rampage. Springboard Moonsault didn't get it. Springboard Moonsault, come on. Missed the elbow drop. Oh, and got caught. Dinner tracks with a bicycle knee. One, two. Kick out at two by Cosmo. Aurora down. 
Oh, a nasty chop. Go for a cover here. Is that gonna be enough? One, two, a kick out at two. And now, back on the offensive goes Cosmo. Wait a minute, look over that UFO. UFO. Spinning her around yeah. crazy. Oh my god. That's how she won the match last week. One, two, oh, and a kick out right before the three count. Elbow shots again and again. Send her into the corner now. Throwing a roar over the top rope. Oh. Is she allowed to do that? Well, it's not legal. And now just stumping a mud all in her. What is it? It's not illegal. I feel like you're just bending the rules for her. I don't think so. Oh, wait a minute! You're an ugly side slam into an anaconda vice! Fun fact, that was actually a rule back in the day. You couldn't throw no one over the top. Right? Oh, what? I'm so oh, glad yeah, I remember that. Wow, well, Cosmo, trying to find Adam now. Roll, the only time Rock and Roll was on WWE, they defended their NWA Tag Team Champions by that. They got thrown over the top rope. Right? Kick right to the midsection now. Aurora going for another possible prison bomb, but Aurora gets out of it. Catches her. Oh, goes for a jawbreaker now. And wow, Cosmo. A series of strikes. Kick right to the midsection now. Float over. And to dust breathe. Oh, and a hammerlock gut buster. Two, and Aurora kicks out, or actually gets a rope break. Mm. And now Cosmo, throwing her into the corner again. What's she looking for here? Springboard. Oh, flying forearm. Drop kick combo! And Aurora ain't stopping there! Oh my god, a stomp run right to the run right to the chest! And now Cosmo! Looking to finish it here! Has got her up on the shoulders! Power slam! Cover! One! Two! Three! And Cosmo! Picks up the win! Do it. I knew I was going to be wrong again. Well, that's where I'm going to stop being a loser splash. I don't know. But Aurora's showing some respect. It's a failure. Next up is Kofi Banks going up against the debuting David Houston. Nice. This will be an interesting match. I'm not picking because I'm going to fucking lose. No, I'm just playing. Probably David. Only because of that drop kick. The drop kick? Oh, I remember now. Mm -hmm. The drop kick that I can't seem to shake off. I can they're both doing the. Yeah, I thought that was funny. One's a Jamaican stoner, the other one's a white stoner from Tennessee. The photographer was like, Yeah, I'm gonna smoke before y'all match. I mean. <laughs> You're right, Splash, that wasn't funny.
There goes Kofi. Comes David. Derek, you know more about these two men than I do. I've seen Kofi Banks in action, and he's a very talented superstar. But what is a what can we see against David Houston? What do you see against David Houston? Or we see uh in David Houston. What can we expect from him? Going oh, up against David they, Houston. Well, Kofi definitely has a <clears throat> The experience factor over David Houston, but we've seen Kofi kind of put this nicely. He's been on a kind of a slump. His in ring movement has been getting better, but you can tell age is getting to him. So immediately kick out, whoa, or immediate uh, roll up into a kick out, I should say. We're gonna see if Kofi Ben can somehow outsmart David Houston, but David Houston should probably have this match wrapped up. Oh, rolls out of the way of the moon salt. Go in now. Hence is your takedown. Maybe teed that shit out of him early. Yeah. Barely kick from the ground up now. Oh, uppercut. Trading shots now. Kofi on the offensive. Springboard into a crossbody. Cover. One. Oh, kick out one. Just before the one count even. That was a beautiful. I'm in a figure four headlock, but David rolling out of it. Oh, double drunk kick. Both of the men missed it. Had the same idea. Yep. Oh, and a swan tongue bomb. COVID now. Vulnerable. Oh, my God. Spring more moonsault onto the spine. And it would drop kick to the side of the head. That could be it right here. One, possibly could two, be kick out it too. That was his basement drop kick just without the running start. Jesus Christ. Not Houston. even a little too early. Hmm? Nope, not even. Oh, insecurity in the back of the skull, and now Houston sliding German suplex. Hmm. The quickness of this man. Very impressive. I was telling you that youth factor. This is what you can see. Mm -hmm. yep. Oh, wait a minute. Hurricane run in the red shoes. What the he hell, David? Huh? He probably deserved that. What's wrong Look with how red he shoes? Ran at <laughs> What the hell? And now Kofi. Oh, wait a minute. We've seen this before. Springboard into that backflip DDT. And Kofi Banks looking to end this here. Wait a minute. David with a kip up. And throwing Kofi off the top rope. Drop kick to the back of the head. And now David Houston. Another drop kick. The trifecta. Tossing Kofi Banks into the corner now. Oh, wait a minute. I don't like what we're seeing here, Derek. Flying boot right to the mush. David Houston now at the top rope. Flying splash to Kofi Banks. Cover one, two. No, kick out it, two. Mm. And David. He's getting anxious. He's getting crazy. Wait a minute, what the hell? Oh my god! He balanced himself on Kofi's knee and insecurity the, the shit, shit out of Kofi. Out of him. God! I'm pretty sure Kofi's out cold now. Wait a minute. He has to be. He kind of caught some of his shin. Oh, wait a damn minute. David Houston now calling for something big here. Springboard! 
DDT! Smack him on his head! Yeah, Cover in the center of the ring! There is no possible One! Way. Two! What the? Kick out no at 2.9! There is no fucking way. Kofi Banks is not giving up here! Springboard! Moonsault! Got out of the way! Kofi now! Kofi back on the offensive! Going after the arms and legs! He just, he's trying to the break the lift arm of David Houston now. Oh, and Segura from the ground. Down the pace. Something like that. Moonsault. Cover on Banks again. One. Two. Kick out at two. It's another shot for Derek. I gotta go check on my piece of me. Go for another moonsault. Shot for Derek. <laughs> Wait a minute. David Houston with a sunset flip and bouncing him across the ring. Tell Kofi to bring it on. Went for another type of maneuver. Both men missed it. Hipped off into a sliding knee strike. Kofi Banks now. Looking for the frog splash. Cover. But a rope break. Kofi and David's legs hit the ropes. Kofi now moving him. Did he get enough time for it? One, two, kick out it, two. Wasted too much time. Didn't wasn't able to hook it up quicker or quicker than he had liked. And now Kofi now. He's got him on the ropes here. Oh, back elbow shot. David went for a springboard counter. Look for her and run. Also countered. And now Houston. And the top rope again. Yeah. David Houston looking for Hurricane Rona. Rolls up Kofi. One. Two. Oh my god. A kick out again. David so Houston. So far away. Indeed. And now. Oh, insecurity to Kofi. What the hell are we looking for here? A moves over the bottom rope. Well, he's going back to the rooms. A middle rope moonsault. One more time. A traffic to moonsault. Cover on Banks. One. Two. A kick out of two again by Kofi Banks. Classic David Houston. How in the hell is Kofi still fighting here? Oh, block the forearm now. Kofi now. Northern left suplex. David can get back up to his feet. Moonsault. Oh my god. No, not a moonsault. A yeah. springboard bulldog. In a knee right to the mush. And now kicking the hell out of David's face. Wait a minute. Rolling flatliner from Kofi Banks. Yeah. Could that be it? One. Two. Three. Kofi Banks. Nails it. Mm. He caught him off guard. He got him. Incredible match by these two. Quick to the point. I like it. Pretty much we're just throwing big move after big move at each other. Indeed. They went all out with one another. Wish they'd go all out with me. That sounds kind of sad. I'm just kidding. So Derek is 0-4, I believe, in terms of these matches. Thanks for reminding me, Splash. I really appreciate that. Not a problem, Derek. Reminding them I'm a failure. I mean, you're in the semifinals. Oh, yeah. <laughs> See me. Next up is a mixed... What the fuck? What the fuck is going on here? Jesus Christ.
Next up is a tag team match, a mixed tag team match between Tyler Styles, the real niggas, Emmy Cage, Drake Okone, and Akira. The party does people. Have a, hmm? Does Draco have a Draco? What that mean? Draco's a gun. Ah, oh, I don't know. Like a submachine gun. Ah, oh, I don't know. You should ask him if he has a Draco. I think you should. It ain't gonna sound right if it comes out of my voice. It has to sound right. Outcoming versus Tyler Styles, the party man. This man likes to go clubbing oh, out with the likes of Matt Rush and Chad. Hmm? He never wanted to go out with me though and get his dick sucked. So. Pause. Wait a minute. That's the word. <laughs> I was gonna say. I mean, it is Pride Month. <laughs> what the fuck? That gotta be. <laughs> Could, can somebody clip that, please? For a little go, clip that. I meant he should have never went out with me and got his dick sucked with some bitches. <laughs> You want to go get drunk with Matt? Yeah. <laughs> 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 mm -hmm. Out of is Amelia Cage. Okay, making her debut as well. Oh my god. She's hot. Oh. Oh, my heart. That shit was funny. Your heart can't, your heart needs to take it. Dreamscape to the lexicon. How the fuck can I do that? Oh. Oh, boy. Oh, man. This pizza, y'all. This pizza is about to stop. I don't know what it is about Tostinos. Get it right. Well, Get it right. Get it right. Get it tight. Get it right. Get it right. Get it tight. Uh, rap music in my dream. Trash. I like Draco. He's a very capable superstar. Very talented. Very hot. I mean, very, very good. Hot in the ring. Very good in the ring. What are you fucking? I'm just kidding. I'm fucking. Right, give me one sec. Alrighty. Drinko taking his sweet fucking time. From Vietnam, Japan, I think Canada, or both, uh, or both these me, me, both of the other competitors from Canada, from Canada, possibly from Canada. And here comes Akira. The Japanese demon.
Here we go. The match begins. Wait. Rolling immediately into a half crab on Draco. Draco runs the ropes now and gets a rope break. Tyler immediately trying to... Tyler immediately getting this match started into his favor straight out the gate. Wound. Kick out at one. And now another ankle lock. But Dwan again. Draco again with the rope break. Oh, huge slam right across the back of the head. And now, Draco. Get right to the midsection now. Over Gourd Buster. Flatten him. And now just the rapid fire knee strikes. Taking him down. And now Tyler throwing him into the ring, into the corner, his own corner. Throwing Tyler into their corner now. And Draco on the offensive now. Tag to Akira. Kick right to the midsection now. What are they looking for here? Looking for a double suplex. Is there a mixed gender tag division? There is not. Not, uh, not for any championships. But since there is, uh, since there's only two divisions, why not combine the two from time to time and have a mixed tag team match? We have the cruiserweights and the women. Why not show them both off in a in a match of well friendly competition away from the championships, away from their own divisions. And as of late, neither of these women, well, Akira lost her chance in the Fatal 4-Way to become one of the contenders for the women's title. Oh! Huge ass shot. And now look for a... Mmm! Big alley-oop slam. What's Akira looking for now? Calling up Emic Age. Oh, duck the drop kick now. In a cage. Elbow shots again and again. I ain't ever had a friend near knock me out with their ass. So much friendly competition. So much for friendly competition. <laughs> yep. <laughs> well, I don't say friendly competition because you're not really trying to win a title here in this match. You're not trying to boost up the ranks. But nonetheless, wins are valuable in this division. Wins are valuable on the show. In any division. Ooh, shoulder tackle. Run out of that. And now Emic Age. Eric and Ronald take down. Wait a minute. Phenomena, weren't you nearly knocked out with somebody's ass the other week ago? And now Kira. Ooh, nasty slap.
Akira now. Tang to Draco. What are they looking for here? Double super kick. No recover. Akira. Celebrate. What the hell? Tyler's still finding this matchup here. And now Tyler. Drove kick. Two very decorated superstars from two very different worlds. Tyler with a double axe handle. And now, a Cloverleaf. A modified Cloverleaf submission hole. Draco could be in trouble here. Draco gets out of the hole now. Get some lower back issues. Oh, duck the kick. And now Tyler. Oh. Series of strikes knocking him down and buzzing open Draco. Draco now on the offensive. Oh, wait. What the hell? He got him up on the ropes and... Oh, my God! The the vicious backbreakers on this man. Driving the knees into the ribs. And a follow-away slam. Cover. One. Oh, and Emic Age breaking up the pin. These women seem to have a lot of problems with each other. And now Drago diving knee across the chest. And now attack to Akira. Hmm? Back. All right. Wait a minute. Emmy Cage. Roll up. Package pin. Whoa. Akira. Raking the eyes to get out of there immediately. And a clothesline into her own corner. Amelia now. Guillotine leg draw. Emic Age on the offensive. Wait a minute. Draco going after Tyler on the outside. Beating the hell out of him. What is Amelia doing here? Springboard. Oh, wait, no. Going on the outside. And now going after Draco. Wait a minute. What the hell? Butterfly. Backbreaker on Draco. And now Akira on the offensive. Take care of that distraction. And now... My gosh, he just ragdolled over the apron. Yeah. And now, here. Yeah. Just tormenting Emmy Cage on the oh wait no curse of the commentators oh mm. went for a sit on and now Kara getting back in the ring stunner on the outside tag to Draco what the? thought I got that wait yeah you did too. Yep. Drago got on that modified uh, clover leaf. And Akira breaking it up. And Red Shoes doing the running man. One, <laughs> two, and Drago with a rope break. Hallelujah. What? Hmm? What? Tell him I paid this man to visit and he paid his bills yet. Hmm. And now Draco just tormenting Tyler Styles.
And now, oh my god, the double shining wizard! Cover on him cage! One, two, mm. no! How mm. on the hell? Yeah, hello, fuck. Oh, wait a minute. Emic H still on the offensive here. Still fighting. Moonsault. And now what's Emmy looking for? The chiropractor. Cover. One. Two. Kick out. Still have nightmares of flying cheeks. And the Crouch Anti Tag Team Wrestling. Go for a flying splash, Jimmy Snooka style. One, two, kick out of two. Bye. You like Jimmy Snooka? I mean, he's alright. Alright. Alright, so what are you Wally, whatever. My name's Wallet T. Franklin, don't you forget yeah, it. Yeah, whatever, Wally, whatever, yeah. Mm -hmm. Can't wait to tell uh, Jimmy Snooker what you really think about him. I, I, I can't wait to see that either. Yeah. Oh my god! Derek, did you just see that? I don't know yet. Flipped her inside fucking out. Okay, now I'm good. Damn. Roll up pin. One, two, kick out at two again. She, she folded her like a lone chair. She had her worse than Chris Breezy. Bulldog. Do you though? No. And now it's Angela Styles. Oh, wait for a knee strike again. Oh wait, kick it! Right in the midsection. And now into the scream amplifier. The scream amplifier. And McCage taking care of Akira. And now Draco is all alone in the ring. Nowhere to go. No one to help him. Can he survive? He taps out. Draco taps out. And Tyler Style stands tall with Emmy Cage. Derek, are you one and four or are you 0 oh and five? I'm oh 0 and five. Oh and fucking five. And I can't stand it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you this poor bastard. Fair. This is not fair. Poor bastard. Hold on one sec. Get down, buddy. Poor bastard. These these guys went through hell. Tyler Styles and Emic Age celebrating their hard fought victory. Almost looking like Team Two Star here. Next up, we go. We have the main event of the evening. We have Monstrosity, Cali Cannon, Rose Satoru, and Selena Albright. This is the fourth and final Fatal 4-Way to determine the fourth and final woman. There's a lot of 4s in here. I'm going to confuse myself. This is the fourth Fatal 4-Way to determine the fifth Fatal 4-Way for the women's title. At FGW Hailfire. I have no idea what to expect in this match. What the fuck? 
What the hell? Huh. Technical difficulties? What the hell? Am I having a stroke here? I'm not the only one having a stroke, right? Okay. Out first, I'm coming out. Kelly Cannon. Collective strokes is a thing, it seems. Indeed. It's almost, infi almost as infectious as yawning. Apparently, some people uh, like Callie a little too much out here. Seems to be the fan favorite here. How did I make you yawn? I didn't even yawn. How is that even possible? You only yawn when somebody else yawns. I'm trying not to yawn right now. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. A-okay. A-o-fucking-k. Oh, damn it. <coughs> All right. Call that animal system. Outcoming next is Selena O'Brien. She looks rough and ready to knock some heads. It's a lot of pyro. Chant, who do you think has the... Who do you think is favored to win in this match? Who do you all think is going to win? Kallik, Enin, and Rose Satoru were button heads when they found out that they were going to be in the same matchup. But we have heard little to no word from Selena Albright, and I didn't have no idea if the other competitor even has a cell phone. Albright scares me, so you, uh, so she went. All right, uh, if she scares you, then what does this woman do? I have seen only women like this in anime. Biggin can kick the shit out of you. She also scares me. <laughs> and out coming finally is. Rose Satoru. I wonder if three fourths of the women in this match will scare me. What's the fourth one do? What's the fourth one do? Whew. Gotcha. Caught lagging there, didn't I? 
And here she is. Rose Satoru. She looks friendly, not scary at all. All four of these women are very capable and very dangerous. So, tread lightly, Phenomeno. There is nothing worse than a crazy white woman. I'll say from experience. You say it, not me. <laughs> I can say it. I'm from the South. And I speak from experience. All four of these women. Let's see what happens here. Albright, Russ Satoru, Cannon, and Monstrosity. Oh my god! Immediately with a knee. And drum kick right to her knee. Oh my. Callie gets her head taken off. And. Rose rakes the eyes. Over a lane drop counter. It's reversal mania in this bitch. Cannon now. Leg draw. Ooh, another knee takedown. She's got Rose up. For a choke slam. And monstrosity now. Grabbing Kelly by the hair. Red Shoes, having the time of his life. Cover. And Rose breaks it up. And now these two women, with the fire red hair and the blue fire face paint, going at it one on one. But now Callie Cannon, interrupting it. Selena went for a springboard of some sort, didn't get it. Knocking down Callie. And now going after Satoru. Get right to the midsection now. And now throwing her over the top rope. And now it's down to Kelly and Satoru. Backstabber. Going for a springboard handspring. Pele kick. And now both the big women back in this matchup. And now they're ganging up on Satoru. The two beauties in this match are getting beat down by the beasts in this match. Here comes a drop trap drop kick. And now a huge back suplex on the apron. Now all these women in trouble now. A sent on. Go for a moose. Oh my god. She got the knees up. Is this match for one fall? Yes, indeed, it is one fall. Only one woman can win this matchup here. There's no elimination. The only elimination that will happen will be... Oh, my God! The only elimination that will happen will be at Hellfire. In the Elimination Fatal 4-Way. As, right, as of right now, we have Ivy Rose Patel. Roxy... Power Lips and Tabitha Blackheart. The winner of this match will be the fourth and final woman to compete for the FGW Women's Championship. And Selena just laying shots. Brutality on Cali. Oh, wait a minute. What the hell is she looking for here? A Tower of London. German suplex. 
Two monstrosity, whoa! A kick out of whoa! A calic ant. And here comes Rose! Looking to do some damage to Albright, but. Albright with those vicious strikes! Bicycle knee! And they're going after Monstrosity! Got her in the corner now. And just the immediate plethora of strikes bringing the woman down. Oh, wait a minute. Sleeper slam. And now Rose in trouble now. Oh, God. Not again. Gorilla press slam. Cali. Oh, Cali went to dodge the punch but didn't dodge the kick. Throwing Callie out of the ring now. And now Satoru with a huge flatliner. Rose now. Look at it. Take advantage here. Going for another handspring. Pele kick. Taking down the big girl. Taking down the monster. Speaking of monsters, here come another. Scrap it. Oh my god. That's why I called her a monster. She laid her flat out with a forearm. Spear! A spear cutting Kelly in half. Cover. One. Two. And Albright breaks up the pin. Another spear. Cover on Albright. One. Two. A kick out at two by Albright. Now kick right to the midsection now. She's got her. Looking for a unprettier. And Kelly now. Dragging Albright away from the ropes. And Kelly. Going after Rose while she's distracted here. Go for a stun gun. And now Albright in trouble. Spear City. Spear Central. Small package driver. And now Kelly in monstrosity. Going one on one again. Headbutt from Cannon. Strike after strike, and now Kelly Cannon looking for something big here. Oh, went for a headbutt, caught with an uppercut. Spine Buster! Flatten her on her ass. Cover one, two. No, Kelly Cannon. Thunderous kick out. Went for a scent on. Got out of the way there. Knee right into the midsection. And now Albright taking advantage. But now. Albright out of there. Went for a drunk kick. And Rose got out of the way. Oh. Went for a knee strike. Albright got out of the way there. And now Monstrosity. Looking to go to town. Oh Kelly Cannon. Oh my god. Absolutely turned her inside out. Nearly knocked the dye out of her hair. Oh no. No. Reverse choke slam. A reverse choke slam on Kelly Cannon. One. Two. And a kick out at two by Kelly Cannon. How is Kelly Cannon still fighting in this matchup? How are any of these women? Still going. And now Albright in trouble now. Going after the beast. Going after this monster. Or well, the monster going after her. Into the, into the ring post. The resiliency on Kelly is unmatched. You are right. Oh my god with a mule kick. Oh no. What's monstrosity looking for here? End of the table. And now. Elbow shots to the midsection. Albright now. Trying to get the advantage over a monstrosity. Elbow shot. And now throwing her into the table. Oh, big boot from Cannon. What the hell is... What the hell is she looking for here? 
Stunner off the ropes. Brain Buster through the table. She just took him monstrosity in this matchup here. Headbutt to Albright. Into a back suplex. Immediate cover. One, two, and Rosatoru breaks up the pin. And now, Kelly Cannon snapped DDT, flattened her on her ass. Or so we thought. Rose is back up to her feet. Choke okay. slam. We just saw Montrosi get put through a table. Good. Yes, she should. Cover one. Two. Breaks up the pin. And now, Satoru in trouble now. Gets thrown into the ropes. As does uh, Monstrosity. Spear into the corner. What the hell is uh, Satoru thinking here? Oh no! Kelly on the offensive. What? Monstrosity towing away here. And now throwing into the corner. Get right of the midsection. And a Face Buster to Cannon. One. How does she go through a table and kick out of that at one? Someone explain that to me. Mm. Throwing Kelly into the corner now. And now Albright. <laughs> oh, no, wait a minute. She's going after. Going after Satoru. Oh, what the hell? Oh, God, no. Albright and Rose Satoru go for a ride! Double choke slam! And now Kelly trying to pick up the pieces! But monstrosity not letting it happen here. Go for cover on Albright! One, two! Monstrosity has a unique ability called not giving a damn. You might be right there. And now a double choke slam! Wait a minute! Went for a dual-handed choke slam and got raked in the eyes. And now Albright looking to take the piss out of Rose here. And now all three of these women. Rose trying to make sure she doesn't get killed by monstrosity. Oh my god! Double team by Kelly and Satoru now. Wayne Clipper. Oh, and no, oh, into a something full Nelson suplex. Both these women eliminated now. It's now it's down to Kelly Cannon in Satoru. What the hell? Kelly now. Looking for a some type of scent on, I guess. But it's scent on, so we make it time. Oh, and, oh, and for an STO, counter dragon suplex to Rose. Cover immediately. One, two. Oh, uh, barely kicking out at two there. And now Albright, back on the offensive, power slam. Going for a headlock. And Rose taking out monstrosity. Rose getting out of that headlock. One, two, kicking out at two. Boom, monstrosity. And now just banging Kelly's head down to the ring floor. Monstrosity caught in that Fuchiwa arm bar. And now Albright gets caught in the power bomb. Oh, wait a minute. Monstrosity now. In trouble here. Oh. Oh, went for a spear. Countered. Knee strike taken out. Satoru. I guess not. Throw Monstrosity into the corner now. And Kelly gets... Kelly throws Rose over the top of him. And now, Red Shoes. Getting the piss taken out of him. Kelly Cannon. Four fifth or a rolling thunder frog splash. Headbutt to Satoru. Spacking her with a back suplex. And now monstrosity now. 
going for a cover on. Going for a cover on Rose. All four women back in the ring here. This doesn't look good for any of them. Callie gets taken out. Rose gets out of that back suplex. Saves herself. Goes for a springboard, misses it. <clears throat> And now, look for a baby cradle suplex. What's up? I said high risk, high reward. High ri she didn't even go for the high risk. She just got a risk and then got taken out. Speaking of risks. Well, I meant to, my, I was talking about the miss springboard. No, I know. She missed the rope. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. And, and now she's choking out Albright. Kelly now. Trying to save. I don't know what she's trying to do. A moonsault on Albright. Oh my god, the bounce. Went for an elbow drop, got it out of the way. And now Monstrosity getting double teamed. And now Rose getting in on the action, but a little too, a little too late. Clothesline the shit out of her. Kellen now. Look for something big here. Throwing her again. Rolling Thunder Frog Splash. Is that the top rope here? Shooting Star Press to Monstrosity. Cutter one, two. Kick out it, two. Rose now. Ace Crusher. Cover. But a rope break. Albright and Kelly are taken down here. Curse of the commentators. Albright gets back up. Albright back on the offensive here. Oh my god, just tosses her. Oh no, wait a minute. Derek, reverse choke slam to Albright. Cover. One, two, three. Mm. Monstrosity. With the victory. Not fair. Monstrosity. Her family. Was put fair, through right hellfire. And we'll be seeing her at hellfire. She is D-E-D -E -D dead. It's not fair. Splash. You need to call the hospital for her. I think I need to call the hospital for a lot of people. Well, yeah. Calling it. Look at this. A double choke slam. Monstrosity is the fourth and final woman to be in the FGW Women's Championship Fatal Four Way at Hellfire. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Ben Wallet T. Franklin, and don't you forget it, Derek. I'm forgetting. Hey, how y'all doing tonight? I'm accompanied by Derek. I forget his last name. And I thank you all for watching this matchup here. I, for, I thank you all for watching this show, and I'll see you all next week on FGW Ignited. Good night, everybody.